Hey, what's up, YouTube? Oh boy, Crypto Tony coming at you with another video. So, what do we got going on today here on Google? Tron TRX news, how Tron's TRX growth might have been predicted. We can go over that one. We also got another one we might go over too. Tron price perspectives. Will TRX be able to join the top five? Hmm. Let me know what you think about my Tron shirt, guys. If you guys are interested in Tron merch, okay, I got rid of the store because I don't got time to maintenance that shit. You are interested in a shirt or a mug or anything like that, my contacts are in the description. So, um, you know, big shout out to everybody for getting your boy to 7,000 subscribers, guys. Really appreciate it. Thank you so much. I'm going to keep pushing out content every day that I can. Vinny's going to be coming on more. And I'm also going to have more guests coming on. You know, Hajin Lee might come back soon. We got a digital asset investor. I, you know, I might have some of these guys on. Maybe even Bitcoin Fund Manager. I don't know. We'll see what happens, guys. We'll definitely see what happens. Hopefully one day we get an interview with Justin Sun. But until then, we'll stick with everybody else that we got. Um, guys, Vinny did a video last night that was phenomenal. Um, you know, it's you can fast forward to all your favorites here for the most part if you wanted to he's got everything there that you need it's freaking hilarious guys you definitely got to go check this video out video out i'm gonna link it here below above i'm sorry um hilarious video guys he's just he rips literally everybody a new asshole we got a you know uh tech cash house crypto crew university a bitcoin fund manager as you can see there hajin lee i mean he's he's pissed because he just got into crypto, and I told him, go follow these people, and he's, like, not happy with it. So, definitely go check him out. Um, let's take a look at my new description here, guys. So, if you're interested in any kind of merch or anything like that, you can hit me on Twitter here. You can hit me on Telegram here. You can hit me on the electronic messaging system here. Email. Um, you go ahead and get yourself a Ledger Nano there. Um, okay, <clears throat> one thing we're going to talk about today... Brave Browser, guys, Coinbase just announced yesterday that you can earn up to 10 bucks for the Brave Browser. Um, you go on Coinbase, you fill out, you do three quizzes, you make three bucks, and then they'll give you seven bucks to download the Brave Browser. So what am I all about, guys? I'm all about making free money. So there you go. Go waste 10 minutes of your time and get $10, $10 in free money. Now, also, um, they, they did it. They got me, guys. I'm Because I'm, I'm tired of Chrome. I'm tired of the freaking pop-ups on the screen when I'm doing a video. Um, I like the feel of this better. I have tried this two or three times, and I've had bad luck with it. Some of the extensions aren't included. Uh, like, the Chrome extensions aren't on there. So, you know, you're still going to have to use Chrome for, like, Chrome for like, uh, like for me, for a YouTuber, we use this thing called TubeBuddy, and it gives us uh, a lot of tools that we need. They don't got it on Brave. kind of blows. But Brave is getting better. Um, so, <clears throat> anyway, um, we got Abra, Uphold. Uphold, we're going to go over as well. Uphold is pretty much kind of tied to Brave a bit. Um, you can get 10 bucks for free if you sign up to that. I mean, literally, I can make you right now, like, probably 50 bucks today. You want to earn 50 bucks today? Go sign up for Abra. Here's my link. What you're going to do is you're going to deposit $5 into your Abra Okay, after you're all set up, I'm going to get 25 racks. You're going to get 25 racks. No brainer. So there's 25 bucks for you right there. Uphold is a little different. On the, um, what is it? I already got 46 people on this. So this is pretty awesome. Now, if you read down here, each referral you must make, you make, must fund their account with at least $100 and have at least $100 in the account by 11.59 p.m. UTC on February 28th. So you still got time to do that, but you're going to get, what is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? 10 bucks. Receive a $10 sign up bonus when you create a free uphold account. So there's 35 buckaroonies for you right there, guys. No brainer. So $35 for today. Uh, Robinhood free crypto trading. If you want to trade crypto, there's no fees. So that's saving money in itself. Um, oh, and by the way, guys, I got myself a mic. 
a nice little blue Yeti. Oh, great. I got pop pop ups coming up again. Fuck. I got to turn those off somehow. Um, I got a blue Yeti coming in, guys. I'm going to get the arm thing. We're going to do it big. We're doing it big. All right. Anyway, um, Coinbase earn a free $10. So that's $45 for you guys. The same thing. I deposit $100. Um, I'll get $10. You get $10. Um, what else we got? BitMEX. I don't really fucks with that, but hey, if you want to go on BitMEX, do your thing. You know, you save 10, 10% there. Uh, if you want to support the channel, you got my Tron address here, BTC address, ETH address, and my EOS address there. Um, of course, there's my financial, uh, not financial advice, not your grandpa, not your dad. Don't get at me with that. <clears throat> All right, let's get into it because I'm tired of talking here. All right. So, Tron Tron, 759 sats. Not too bad, guys. I'm not too, too concerned here. Um, you know, a couple of people are like, oh, you put out a bearish article yesterday and, uh, you know, just blah, 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 this, and Tron shouldn't pay you. And listen, first of all, Tron doesn't pay me. That's number one. Get that through your head, okay? I'll always stay realistic with you guys. I'm never going to come out here and say, yeah, it's going on. It's doing this. It's doing that. That's why we're going to go over that article that I uh, pulled up earlier, Okay. Because it's realistic, guys. This this guy right here is a realistic guy. And some of you may not take him seriously because he's got cousins like Vinny. But who gives a shit, guys? A lot of the... L let me tell you something. A lot of these serious guys out here that you'll see on Vinny's video here, guys. Like, uh, you know, you got Alessio Rastani over here saying that... Uh, it could go to a million dollars. I mean, he says it in the in the video for the most part. Always saying this, saying that. He's 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 mainly wrong all the time. Um, you know, you got this guy, the Moon, who's like 15 years old. I, you know, I, I don't know. He's got a shit ton of subscribers. I don't know what's going on. Hajin Lee has always been wrong. I'm so sick and tired of this guy still sticking around. You're gonna see more videos on Hajin Lee from me and from Vin because I'm just tired of this freaking clown. Now, the YouTubers I like. Are of course ready set crypto this channel is freaking bomb guys freaking bomb it's awesome if you scroll all the way to 19 minutes you'll see Vinny bump into that shit it's awesome tech cash house it's pretty much garbage guys I mean this isn't even honestly in order I just he just went through this shit whatever but tech cash house shut the fuck up seriously you talk too much bro crypto daily doesn't put out daily videos anyway let's get back into the price <clears throat> so Take a look at the four hour here. We are in this consolidation channel for the most part. Now you guys are probably wondering, Tone, what are these black lines at the top here? Okay, I'm gonna tell you what those black lines are at the top because we gotta be aware because this is a realistic channel, all right? I'm not gonna come out here and, and talk shit to you guys. Now, I got it pulled out from the top to this top and doing like a little apex. Now, this, in my opinion, would be the worst case scenario for Tron and Tron, okay? But again, I'm not going to I'm not going to come at you guys and say this is exactly what's going to happen or this is exactly what's going to happen because you get half of these assholes out there like Hajin Lee that you will get wrecked, guys. Hajin Lee was saying Tron was going a dollar 50 back in uh February of last year. Look at where that got him. People, you guys, he has he's on Bitcoin live and people pay for his analysis. Can you believe this shit? You can't make this up. You cannot make this up. But the problem is that they're losing steam, so they have to go on YouTube now and do more promotion. That's what they're doing. Because prior to uh, Bitcoin Live, he was always free. But now he wants to get paid because he wants to augment his due diligence. I'm done. I'm tired. I would never pay a freaking dime for that crapola. Anyway, so um, here's what I see, guys. Here's what I see, okay? We, um, we have our... You know, if we came from this top down here, we obviously went through that. So we're definitely above that. I don't see us going back. Now, let's just say there is a dump. What levels do we have to look out for? Well, we have support here. We have support here at 542. And then we have longer term support, um, you know, let's just say by April at 407. Now, if Bitcoin picks its shit up, you guys need to understand that if Bitcoin picks its game up, these coins are going to come down. I don't care if it's Tron, BTT, um, freaking porno coin, tits coin, whatever the hell it is, it's going down because Bitcoin's coming up. Again, got to be realistic with you guys. Got to be honest because that's what's going to happen. So we need to know what's going to happen in that event. Your coins are going to lose Satoshi value, 
while they're going up in USD value, guys, okay? So let's go over to the USD chart. That was the, um, <clears throat> that was our BTC chart. So again, on the USD chart, guys, building strong freaking support here on the 200 EMA, guys. This is solid. This is what I want to see. I would like to see this go on for another two months, honestly, because if we can make it all the way out to here somewhere, that would be super strong, okay, for support. Um, now, of course, we broke out of this wedge, like I was saying, when it happened. I was telling everybody, you're in a humongous freaking bull pennant, bull flag, whatever the frick you want to call it. It looks good, right? It looked good. So, pull, flag, peace, all right? Now we're piecing out above this 200 moving average and... You know, sky becomes the limit after 10 cents for the most part. So we are, you know, you got resistance at around 4, 4.1. This whole area, as you can see, 3.65, 3.8. There's a lot of resistance here. A lot of trading was going on in these levels. But like I said, guys, if we could smack up this 10 cent mark, guys, game over. Game freaking over, in my opinion. So again, guys, we still have time, I'm sure. Um, you know, listen, this is a long-term investment for me, guys. I don't know about all you guys, but this is a long-term investment for me. Um, you know, I think Tron is a solid freaking project. I mean, that that's, you know, like I said, enough said there. Um, I've gone through my share just like all the rest of you. Normal dude over here, okay? I'm gonna move myself back over here. I like it over here better. Um, what the hell happened here? All right, there we go. Hey, I'm back. Um, you know, listen, I've I've watched a lot of these YouTubers with their TA and all this stuff. Guys, they're always wrong, okay? They're always wrong. So either you're going to have somebody give you realistic news and realistic shit, or you're going to have somebody telling you that it's going to the moon, and guess where it's going? To the floor at the end of the day. I mean, look, you got, again, you got Hodgin Lee shorting, taking shorts at $3,400 Bitcoin, guys. It's if this guy's not a sheep, I don't know who is, because he keeps saying that he's not. But he is, to be honest with you. He's a freaking sheep. He's not an analyst, in my opinion. All right, so big crypto tone taking over the taking over the airwaves here on Google. All right, let's check it out. So, how's Tron TRX growth might have been predicted? Let's check this bad boy out real quick. See what they got going on here. Crypto Globe. Never heard of this. Uh, Never heard of this news site, but the article looks good and it popped up. So let's read the shit. House Tron TRX growth might have been predicted. So Datalite is a unique tool. <sighs> Starting on the 10th of December of last year, Tron showed steady growth, doubling in price in an unstable market. So as you guys know, we did double and all you guys were crying. You guys are still crying. On the comments some of you some of you guys are awesome all, most of you guys are awesome on the comments but some of you guys are that's ah, going to the floor da, 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 this listen starting on december 10th of last year tron showed steady growth doubling that's two so you know it took us another step up not back got it good at the moment tron is in eighth place in terms of capitalization not far from the top five could that have been predicted we think so as there were a few indicators that this kind of growth might have been coming, and Crypto Tone was saying it all along. Okay, Tron and Tron analysis. With the increasing amount of Tron mentions on Twitter, there is a significant rise in the number of addresses on this platform. Look at that, bam. Okay, we got a bam there. In spite of the drop of Tron's price, the main indicator indicators of this blockchain, the number of transactions and the number of addresses are constantly increasing. It might indicate that the community strongly supports the project. It might. Let's this. Let's double check this, guys. Let's make sure this is accurate information. Okay. 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 There you go. Accurate information, there, guys. I'm not gonna come on here and and talk shit and say it's not accurate. Listen. Listen. They need to get their act together with these transactions, guys. They gotta pick it back up. It is what it is. We got some work to do, guys. Justin, you got some work to do out there. Figure it out. You know. But. And it, besides that, who cares? Everything is looking good. Um, I'll probably do a, a later, a, a, you know, maybe a, a, a side by side with uh, with EOS. 
Again, EOS making big moves in the space when it comes to transactions per second. Um, but with accounts, I don't know if it's the, I, I think Tron's got a lot more accounts, um, which is odd. It's, it's odd. There's a lot of people that say EOS fake their numbers. I'm not going to come out and say they say they do, but that's the, that's the word on the street. You know, that's what they're telling me. Uh, where was I? All right, we're going back to this, going back to this. All right. So here's a read. Let, let's read what this article is again, guys, how Tron's TRX growth might've been predicted. So how do you make a prediction? You know, right? You could say, oh, my coin is going to do so good, this, that, and the third. They bought Bit BitTorrent, okay? You know what BitTorrent is? Vinny went over the freaking uh, video on how to use BitTorrent, okay? We're going to do more of those in the future, but definitely go watch Vinny's video on, and I'm going to link that one here too. Um, go watch his video on, uh, sorry, I know I got to take you guys away, but go watch this video if you're interested. Got almost 800 views. If you're interested in using BitTorrent, and getting paid for seeding, go watch this video. So not only are you gonna go in the description and Coinbase uphold all these accounts that you need to get so you can make free money today, go watch this too so you can get some free money in the future. Guys, I don't do anything anymore. This is like what I do. I do YouTube and I do other things related to the computer for the most part. I mean, I don't even leave my house anymore, honestly. Well, that's not true, I leave my house, but I, I don't need to. This is what you got. You, you get passive income going. Just do it. All right. BitTorrent acquisition. It is widely known that the summer of 2018, Tron acquired the most popular torrent tracker in the world, BitTorrent. That gate already gave Tron some momentum. A few weeks ago, it was announced that BitTorrent will, will release its own BTT token on the Tron platform. So, guys, they bought BitTorrent. That's all we got to say. Blockchain activity. After transitioning to its own platform at the end of June 2018, the number of blockchain transactions on Tron has steadily increased. I'm not reading any more after that because there you go. I mean, more, more facts, facts for you guys, not, not, not tone feeding you, feeding you shit, feeding you uh, st stale cannolis with, with rotten cheese in the middle. Ambitious goals. Justin Sun, CEO and founder of Tron, has set Number of ambitious goals for 2019. One, enter top four of cryptocurrencies at coin market cap. Two, make Tron's ecosystem larger than Ethereum. Three, bring 100 million users of BitTorrent into Tron ecosystem. That's already done. We don't even need to worry about that. Four, make Tron the largest decentralized system. I think that's pretty much already done too, but hey, that's up for debate. While these goals may seem highly ambitious 2018 was undoubtedly an impressive year for Tron e Tron steps to legitimacy Tron is trying hard to solve problems with respect to legal status so they're doing their thing they hired the SEC lawyer they're on Forbes they're on Bloomberg they're talking about them come on see look they're talking about right here da David Lampart former United States Security Exchange Commission SEV supervisory attorney like, is this legit, guys? Is this legit? Did they really do this? <clears throat> the market responded immediately and corresponded to increase the Tron by 32%. There may or may be not be solid fundamentals underpinning Tron's growth, but you don't have to follow every news story and be a blockchain specialist to make accurate trading decisions. You can follow the mood of the market influenced by a collection of indicators. So, very good article here from crypto globe i also wanted to take a look at that other one because it seems like there's some more good news in there guys tron price perspectives will trx be able to join crypto top five when we want to know when right when's it gonna happen so let's see when they're saying it's gonna happen again guys there's no wrong or right or wrong answer wow i like this image a lot so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna save it I'm going to say that I might even use it in the clickbait. Who knows? Anyway, Tron price perspectives. Tron currently sitting comfortably in the number eight spot with a market capitalization of $1.7 billion and trading at two and a half cents against the United States fiat uh, scam, scam coin dollar. Over the last few months, Tron has managed to gain a lot of traction and new followers. The token has been steadily climbing the ranks and has risen several spots in coin market cap list of top 10 of top currencies 
It is currently sitting comfortably at the number eight spot with a mark. We just read that. Why would you put that twice in the article? You dot today. Come on, come on. The Tron project was initially launched in September 2017 by a Singapore-based Foundation Justice Sun. Give me something good, guys. Give me something good. A rather big part of Tron's marketing has been to emphasize the fact that Tron, their native crypto asset, can sustain 200 transactions per second while Ethereum is capable of only 25. So um, we haven't proven that yet, guys. Just letting you know. Full disclosure here, guys. We're only at 748. So when? We want to know that too. As investors, I think we have the right to know that information. So what I think is more important is the Tron Foundation has acquired BitTorrent. I, come on, come on. You're giving me all the same shit here. Considering all these developments, Tron's team is clearly proactive, delivering a steady stream of news and making headlines almost every week. I would say almost every day. Constantly being on people's minds is one of the best ways to gain followers. That's what I said, guys. That's why I do two maybe sometimes even three Tron and Tron videos a day um, because they, they, this, this, they pump news, 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 and they want to stay relevant, guys. They want to stay relevant because they have the technology they, and they also have the marketing team behind them. Like I said, guys, it's not about the stigma of, ooh, Tron's a shit coin and Tron stinks. Tron has that stigma. Get that out of your head. Tron actually works and they're making moves to make their coin work even better by doing everything that they're doing. All right, so if they are able to deliver on their promise, their market cap will continue to rise. Why wouldn't it, right? It's not out of the question to see Tron TRX reach top five as soon as summer 2019. <clears throat> okay, so I, you know, I, I think that is a, um, yeah, that's a great way to put it, guys. I like what they got played out here too. This is, um, you know, they got this kind of like a, like, a, like an ascending, well, not, no. I forgot what they call this triangle triangle breakout joint where it should break out to the upside and hit five and a half cents. Wouldn't that be nice? So Tron lost ground against the U.S. dollar for the better part of 2018. But unlike other digital coins, it has shown signs of bullish pressure pressure. The, to the token hit its low and bottomed out in late November when it hit almost under a penny, which, would, which really sucked. I remember those days. Since November 2018, the pair has been constantly climbing and even managed to pierce the resistance at 2.8 uh, a bit without breaking it convincingly. Um, what the hell is Al? You know what? I am, What the fuck is this? I always see these in these articles. I mean, we don't talk like that in America here. I don't understand this shit. However, after the initial false breakout, price returned to that level and has been repeatedly bump, bumping against it, which makes me think a break of resistance could come in the near future. So pretty much, yeah, it's touched it. You know, this is what we've been going over, guys. Um, I don't really like to cut off wicks like this, but in this case, I do get where this guy is pretty much coming from for the most part. Um, you know, you basically had, um, you know, if we, if we do a, uh, you know, I think we'd have to, maybe do like a, I think he's on like a two hour chart or something like that. So as you can see guys, it's pretty much um, broken this level, this level here for the most part twice. And you have a, um, you know, a diagonal slope coming up here. So if we go from, I know there's a lot of lines here guys, but if we use just this green line here, along with this black line, and we kind of stay on this trajectory here, we could see a breakout. Now, again, we do have the airdrop coming up. So the breakout's got to happen like soon. Um, and a lot of guys, you guys have been mentioning that the um, block height needs to reach 6.6, .6, which I think we might hit before the 11th. So there is a possibility you could get your airdrop prior to the 11th. Another one of you guys came on and said the 11th is actually the 10th here in America or on, the, you know, wherever you're at, Mexico, Argentina, fucking Venezuela, wherever the hell you're at, um, on this side of the world, it's going to be a day behind for the most part. So let's get into the rest of it here. So the 200 day exponential moving average is flat, which is the current situation means that a trend change is possible and does not indicate necessarily a ranging market. Also, the pair is supported by a bullish trend line 
That could help push price higher. The relative strength index RSI is trading in the middle of the range, which means there's room to move higher. Daily chart support bullish trend line at 0 0.0180. Daily chart resistance 2.8 cents. Most likely scenario break of immediate resistance followed by printing of new high uptrend develops developments continue. So they're saying that that's the most likely scenario. I would tend to agree here because if you're looking at the way they have it mapped out here, you have a channel that we stayed in pretty much. We broke down under that channel. We came up and now we're above the 200 day moving. Out. I told you guys the 200 EMA for the daily is, is massive guys. It's, it's massive. You have to be um, you know, above it to be bullish. And in this case, we are above it. So we are bullish still. Um, we're also hovering on it on the USD chart. Um, they might actually be looking at it on the USD. Yeah, they are. They're looking at it on US dollar here, guys. So they're definitely, they're definitely watching my videos, I think. Alternative scenario, retracement lower based on mini uptrend exhaustion and RSI position. A new attempt to break current resistance should soon follow so regardless they're saying look even if we get hit we should be bullish here guys um you know again a lot of you guys are like it's overextended it's gonna come down it could it, it very well could i'm not i'm not saying that um that it can't now even if the price drops into satoshi value where it has room to fall you know you still have strong support on this 200 ema um, if Bitcoin does decide that it wants to, uh, you know, get its shit together and go back up. So, um, for me, the chart looks great for the long term, guys. I don't see where this looks bad. We have here a higher high, okay? We have higher highs, okay? This was uh, our high from back in uh, November of 2018. It came down. We came back up. We tried to hit it. And then boom, we came back and we finally got that higher high, guys, at three and a half cents. And now we're consolidating. Now we're just consolidating. So whenever there's a, a higher high is made, it typically means there's a trend change coming into effect. That's what we're seeing here, guys, especially with us being above these, these EMAs. We're pretty much above all of the EMAs right now, which is massive. So hopefully Tron can lead us into the next bull market. Bitcoin gets its shit together and we start freaking mooning already. All right, so that about covers everything. Big ups to everybody. Thank you so much for the 7,000 subscribers. I don't know what I'd do without you guys. Definitely go watch Vinny's video if you're interested in finding out who's full of crap and who's not full of crap. Majority of them are full of crap, but I don't want you guys getting scammed in this crypto space. So with that being said, like, subscribe. Turn that post notification. Highlights, boy, peace.